Evening. I'm weather forecaster Tyler Ryan here to give you your updates uh, going into the weekend. We actually have the carnival tonight. We have a lot going on. We have rain coming in, warmer tissues. We'll give you a full update full update on that coming up here later in the forecast. But right now we are seeing a live look here on the radar. Uh, the showers that we saw in the morning have been making its way out of this area, moving more east. So we are still, still seeing a little bit of cloud, but we do expect that to make its way out. And we're going to see some sunny skies coming up later in the forecast. But right now here in the current, we're actually looking at the scramble light. We're sitting at 64 degrees. Those winds are coming out of the west southwest at 21 miles per hour. So it's actually been really windy on the backside as that cold front did push through overnight and into the morning on BCBM. Bringing trading in those rain for winds. Uh, and if you look here in the current winds throughout the state of Indiana, in Indianapolis at 31, coming out of the west southwest, Terre Haute at uh, 21, and Bloomington at 13. So, majority of the middle of the state, you're seeing those gustier winds. The southern part or latter half of the state, you are seeing a little more calmer winds, but still seeing those gusty conditions out there for the majority of Indiana. But look here in the current temperatures. We're at 64 here in Muncie, 60 in Kokomo, and 62 in Indianapolis. So majority of the state, we're actually around the 60s. We're actually a lot cooler than what we were feeling about 24 hours ago, almost 20 degree uh, coolers indicated here on this 24 hour temperature change. If you look up here in Muncie, we're actually at se uh, negative 17 degree uh, cooler when we were feeling over 24 hours ago. Shelbyville at 14 and Lafayette at 21 degrees. So yesterday we hit our 80 mark for the first time of the year, but then we have cooled off, but then we will see another warm up trend coming up later in the forecast. Here for the carnival forecast, when the gates do open around 7 p.m., temperatures will be at 57 degrees, mostly clear. Those winds come out of the, uh, the southwest, so a little more calmer winds for it. And then when you start closing, gates close at 1 a.m., temperature does cool off a little bit down to the 49 degrees, so make sure you do grab that jacket if you are going to head out to the carnival uh, for your evening. Uh, those winds are still going to remain calm at uh, southwest at 7 miles per hour. We're going to see those mostly clear skies, so it should be a beautiful night, just a little bit chilly. But so you do grab that light jacket if you are heading out the door. We actually are tracking in some wind. So Friday and Saturday, we're going to remain majority clear. We are going to see some clouds start making its way late Saturday night. And this is the rain that we're talking through that's going to be coming into our viewing area for majority of Sunday. Uh, 12 p.m. is when it starts making its way. And then for uh, really early Sunday, around 4 or 5 a.m. is where I've seen those heavier pockets indicated by yellow and orange. And actually because of this rain, we're actually going to see start seeing that severe weather uh, down south. Uh, the SPC has actually issued a moderate uh, risk, which is actually one below uh, a high risk. So the, they actually indicate off of a five color scale, uh, pink is high, moderate is red, orange is enhanced, slight is yellow, and uh, marginal is the darker green. So moderate risk is actually we are going to see a prob good probability of severe weather down south. So we're seeing some hail, some isolated tornadoes, or possibly some of these tornadoes could be strong. So if you have any family members down south, make sure they are uh, going to be taking shelter and watching the, uh, the TV or the radar for uh, that tomorrow severe weather. What we are seeing that bringing that rain in uh, for uh, early Sunday morning. And then for your weekend forecast, Saturday's actually going to be a beautiful day. We're going to have a high of 62 degrees, mostly sunny. Those winds are going to uh, actually increase up from coming out of the east to 10 to 20 miles per hour. And then for your Sunday, we are going to see that rain make its way into our viewing area uh, as that we we're tracking that cold front making its way as well. Uh, it's going to actually cool off after this passes through, but we're going to see some rain, thunderstorms of possibility. Winds coming out of the south at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Those chances of rain is 80%. And then for your seven day forecast, Saturday and Sunday, we're going to be, uh, temperature going to be made mild at around 62 to 61 degrees. That rain is going to be pushed through. But once that rain makes its way out, we could see an isolated uh, shower early morning on Monday. But those temperatures do drop actually well below average uh, for your 51 on Monday. Actually, the average temperature for this time of year is actually 61 degrees. And then for your Tuesday, Wednesday, warm back up above average for your highest 68 degrees. And then we are tracking another system for uh, the for the latter half of the week for Wednesday and Thursday. We could see some more rain chance, so make sure you tune in the NLI weather uh, for any of those updates on that. We'll get that to you. Uh, make sure you follow us at NLI weather on Twitter.